This has been a real pioneering effort out here. The logistics were just tremendous. I mean, getting all the equipment out here, arranging for all the people, the officials, grading the track. I mean, I'm in awe right now of how we got all this stuff here. We got a track made. Mike Cook has just done a tremendous job of preparing the track. It's as good as it will ever be for a land speed event. container was supposed to have been here a month ago and we were going to pre-drill and do all the stuff prior to being here. So all we had to do was just spot face everything, you know, just put a little drill on it and walk away. But uh, container didn't even show up until last night. When I saw the two containers that were supposed to be here almost a month ago show up in front of the hotel. I, up until that point, I was so skeptical that any of this was gonna work. How come you got a tear in your eye? <laughs> <laughs> I'm crying, I'm so happy. This is fantastic. There's just case after case of nail biting deadlines that no the container didn't get off the ship oh customs is holding it up and we can't get it finally i wasn't so sure until just now because every day it's been tomorrow 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 we thought it was going to be here before we got here and that was three days ago but it was just like i'm seeing it with my own eyes they're actually here they're going to you know, we're going to maybe be able to do this. What's happening today is we got our container out last night, and so we brought it out this morning. The timers are in here setting all the clocks up, getting ready to string some wire. We're putting an FM repeater up, which we had to bring all from home. Jamie, let it loose a little. Let him pull it that way. There. Absolutely beautiful, Why yeah. I mean, 4,000 square miles of beautiful pristine salt like this it's just a land speed racers dream come true mike akative and the top one bought us a brand new repeater so we're setting the antenna up setting the <coughs> clocks up and then uh, tommy and dan warner are out setting the sign boards up Once we get the signboard set up, we'll put the polisher out there and start polishing the racetrack and then put the center mark on it. And then hopefully the last thing we do is put the blue line down. Our bike is still not here. It's supposedly being offloaded on a boat today in a, in a port in Chile and it needs to clear customs. We're still crossing our fingers and hoping it gets here. If doing this was easy, it'd be land racers all over this place, but it isn't. And we just need a, we just need a couple of good days and I think we can accomplish what we came out here to do.